St. Vincent's is important to me because although I'm only a sophomore, I know St. Vincent's is shaping me into the woman I'm becoming. We were founded in 1845 by the Sisters of Mercy. Welcome to St. Vincent's Academy. I am a 1976 graduate of St. Vincent's Academy, and I could never have imagined 40 years ago when I walked through these doors as a 14-year-old what this school really means. We've got young women right now here who in 10 years will be doing every possible thing we can think of. We've already had attorneys, judges, doctors, college professors, um, army officers, engineers, scientists, worlds and worlds of teachers, worlds and worlds of nurses. This is all very positive and it's all a great thing and they all remain with that connection to St. Vincent's. St. Vincent's is, has been pretty much a lifetime endeavor for me. I love it very much, and I'm very proud of all that we have achieved here. As 14-year-olds, they come here facing a four-year challenge. They're at an awkward age, in a sense, a challenging age. And with all the education and opportunities that we provide, we see it year after year. They come in as 14-year-old children. They graduate as 18-year-old young women, well on the way to maturity. St. Vincent's means to me the empowerment of young, educated women who come and strive for excellence in academics as well as in sports and to become a young lady and to go out in the future and become future leaders. As a St. Vincent's graduate in 2006, St. Vincent's not only prepared me academically in college, but also professionally in life. And what I like about St. Vincent's is that there's something for everybody. There's not like a norm that you have to follow. We're not just known for our sports or academics or our arts. There's just something for everybody. We provide a college preparatory curriculum for our students while offering enriching electives in theater, the arts, math, and science. What St. Vincent's means to me is um, just indescribable. Uh, St. Vincent's is a blessing. It is a blessing for the city. It's a blessing for any girl that ever, ever comes here. I think I should just sing the fight song. St. Vincent's Academy is greatest of all. Come forth and sing her praises. This Academy is so important to me because when I walk through the halls, I know I'm part of something bigger. St. Vincent's means everything in the world to me. When I first interviewed uh, with Sister Helen some years ago, uh, she said, come here and you can teach. That's what St. Vincent's means to me. It gives, I love to teach and it gives me an opportunity to do just that without a whole lot of distraction. When I think about when I first started here as a teacher, as a new teacher with little experience, um, I had the opportunity to uh, use the experience of the other teachers around me to help me find my own philosophy for teaching and um, find ways to make the course the way I saw uh, was important for the students to learn. And it's a loving environment and everybody around cares for one another and no matter how old you are or what grade you're in, teachers that you met in ninth grade, they still come to you and they ask you how you're doing and they're always consoling if they see one of you down. So when I think of St. Vincent's, I think of the word love. What we offer them here is a physically safe, supportive environment in which they can mature as adolescents without uh, some of the competition that you have from boys. It offers at least twice as many leadership roles as you would have in other schools. The people, the mercy tradition that they are in, which really does encourage growth of faith, hope for the future, and youth, and they can see youth, young women leading. They see that every day 
It becomes ingrained in them. My favorite quote from Catherine McCauley talks about, we must fit our young women for earth without unfitting them for heaven. And that's truly what we do here at St. Vincent's Academy. St. Vincent's is important to me because it's a place where I can learn more about my faith and become closer to God. We provide them with an atmosphere that is based on spirituality and compassion. And our goal is to make them the best person they can be. St. Vincent's is a place of faith. It is a place where stereotypes do not matter. Just because you look a certain way doesn't mean you are a certain way. And it doesn't mean that anywhere you come from, you're going to be a certain way. You are determined by your academics and how you make high school for you. I think St. Vincent's is important because wherever you are, or wherever you came from, or whoever you are, you always find a place to fit in. It's just such a family and a sisterhood. My name is Brianna Foran. I'm the class of 2000, very proud graduate of St. Vincent's Academy. When you add up all of our family, there's probably 30 to 50 graduates, including aunts, cousins, grandmothers. My mom is third generation, I'm fourth generation. And to me, St. Vincent's is a long line of tradition. My grandmother went here, my mom went here. Uh, my aunt was principal here and she's a sister of mercy, and my mother wrote the alma mater back in 1945. My mother was a graduate of 1925, had three sisters who preceded me, so I was always looking forward to coming to St. Vincent's. St. Vincent's has been a part of my life for as long as I can remember, because I grew up in this neighborhood. I've been here as a student, as a teacher, as a guidance counselor, and as principal and now I'm assistant to the principal. And St. Vincent's is really important to me because it's the place where I'm building my lifelong friendships. I've cherished the education, the faith background, um, the academics, everything I got here and the friendships and the sisterhood that I made here that I still have today with all of my friends. The walls just resound with tradition and uh, everything that's good in life. It is, it is such a different and wonderful place. We're asking you today to help contribute to the future and the success of St. Vincent's Academy. We have four main areas that we really need your help with. The first area is facilities, the second scholarship, the third endowment, and of course the fourth is technology. And the capital campaign I feel is very important for us because it will enable us to move forward technologically and advance in our academics. St. Vincent's is a pretty lady, inside and out, but her face is showing a little bit of the test of time, and um, there are a few cracks and wrinkles. But we need to keep the foundation, the shell, in order in order to continue to serve our children of the Catholic community. We desperately need the help of our benefactors. Uh, we want to continue doing what we have done for the past 167 years. Um, and God willing, we'll continue to do for another 167. Something like 80% of the cost of running the school uh, is paid for by tuition. The rest of it has to be made up in other ways. So the maintenance of the physical facility, uh, the expansion of our you know, computer uh, apparatus in the school, all of that has to come from uh, a capital campaign or from our annual giving. We hope that people that care about the school, whether they went here or not, but see it every day when they drive down Liberty Street, will want to keep this school here so that generations of St. Vincent's girls um, can send their children here and that one day you know, they can say, I went there, my children went there, and now I know my grandchildren will be going there. Well, I've got five daughters, three of graduates, a wife that's graduated, and I see my other two daughters attending, and I see their children also graduating from this great establishment. We feel that we have been successful all these years, and we want to continue that success with your help. With your contribution, you will help ensure the continued development of young women in this community 
and the future of this great school. We have a website and the website is www.svaga.net. Click on donate and there's a drop down box and the first box is capital campaign. You can click on that and you can make a donation with your credit card. You can certainly call the development office or you can email us and we will make sure that your donation goes to the correct place. And anything you could do to help the capital campaign would be so greatly appreciated. Your pledge makes a difference truly, so thank you very much.